with Mario Spray, 2011 ADCC Super Fight winner. You want to uh, tell us a little bit about your fight, how it went, how things are going? Well, uh, we had a we had a pretty decent battle against Enzo Gracie. We went to over two overtimes. Uh, regular time, ten minutes plus five and five. And uh, the last overtime, I was able to take him down and pass his guard and um, make five zero and win the trophy. It was a pretty good fight. Uh, I had some problems with the mat. It was very slippery. I couldn't hold the guy in the door. But at the end of the, the match, I could manage the gap and make some points and win the fight. Yeah, that's excellent work, man. And is there anyone that stood out to you in the tournament in any of the categories? Oh, uh, there was there was a lot of guys. There, there were there were some good guys. Um, um, who impressed me the most, uh, for sure, Andre Galvão, who won both divisions. Yeah. He's been training hard for a long year, or for long years already, and uh, I think he was he was inspired this this tournament, and uh, he was just impressed. Mm -hmm. Would you ever see yourself wanting to fight them if you if they were in your well, your time? I think it's gonna be. Pretty hard. Uh, we're gonna have uh, Abu Dhabi again in two years. I don't know what's gonna happen in a few years from now. I'm feeling good, training hard with, uh, with professional women and fighters uh, such as Rodrigo Nogueira, uh, Anderson Silva, yeah. uh, Junior dos Santos, and all those guys, and a bunch of, of, of other young kids that are uh, pretty good before. Uh, I'm training in boxing and what I just for fun now. But who knows? Uh, after this fight, anything can happen. I got some exposure. And uh, the thing that, that I love most in life is training. Yeah, for sure. Um, who was your toughest opponent in your fighting history? Well, I had many of tough opponents. I would say my. My tough, toughest fight was against Burrito Ninja. I tried and I lost actually my points. Yeah. And uh, actually, it's my favorite fight because uh, I could see that to kill me is a different, is a difficult task. Yeah. I got knocked down in the first round, first 10 seconds. I got the busted knee. Later on, I had a surgery and I managed to. Fight 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. So it was a good fight. Okay, and how about grappling? Who's your toughest opponent? Uh, grappling, Jiu Jitsu, no doubt, Roberto Gordo, yeah. the half guard invented yeah. from Baja Gracie. Many others, but I think he was the one who gave more more trouble. Yeah. And how do you see the scene now? I mean, a lot of the top guys are training in America and Brazil. I mean, what's the difference now? I think, I think it's a natural thing. Uh, America was um, the richest country in the world. Now it's going through so much economic problems. Brazil is, is, is I think, there's a, there's a new uh, thing going on. A lot of fighters are coming back and training, doing their camps in Brazil. Uh, now with UFC back in, in Brazil again, we, I've heard that they're going to have three shows next year. Right. So a lot of sponsors are showing up. I think it's a natural thing. Uh, people have to f look for the best for the families. But uh, pretty soon, uh, I guess, uh, it's, uh, we're going to have the opposite going on. Some guys from America coming to Brazil. Okay. So when do you think we'll see you again? Either on the mat or...? Maybe. I hope so. Yeah? Pretty soon, yeah? Pretty soon. All right. Thank you very much for the time. Congratulations on ADCC. Thank you.